what's so great? The Knicks win a playoff game, or I don't get it. What, like, what's so great about my hometown right now? I just can't remember the last time New York felt this alive. Cool. I mean, I know we're excited as a city to just have a little post-COVID normalness that feels a bit with restaurants and bars open and no one's wearing masks walking outside. It's been beautiful weather. But to actually be able to be proud to be a Knicks fan, to want to wear <laughs> orange again, a color that looks terrible on most people. <laughs> but now, uh, with yes. my tan, the orange is all I'm wearing for the next month. So, I mean, you might disappear with your tan uh, and some wearing orange. <laughs> so, uh, you're from the Bronx, right? Is that where you're from? Born? I'm, I'm originally from the Bronx, but okay. I grew up most of my life in New Jersey. Um, so, that's why my tan is orange. Uh, but, <laughs> uh, this right. has been a while since even the discussion of Madison Square Garden being yes. electric. The last time it was electric, it was in a movie, you know, that, that, that Adam Sandler probably did like 15 years ago. I can't even recall. So, it, look, I'm, I'm not really trying to make you that jealous, just no. so slightly. Uh, but no, it's, the, city, the city's hopping, and it's good. Well, it's great. I mean, and then maybe you should help me with this, Diana, since you're you have such a sunny disposition, as you've already established, and... And you also resemble the uh, the uh, yellow orb or orange orb <laughs> in the sky, um, as you've just established. I just can't get past the fact that I hate James Dolan so bad, and that this makes him happy, and that I I, I don't know. I I know I'm going to have to let this go at some point in time, but you know the fact that we're not all one big happy organizational family like Oakley's not on board. I can't be on board. You know what I mean? Like it's it's very difficult for me to Look, separate winning, the two. Winning cures all. They say that, and I haven't experienced it here in New York in a while. Mm -hmm. uh, it is incredible how much you can put past, put your hate in the back pocket. Uh, when okay. you get a little taste uh, of what this feels like. So I, I hear you on the, uh, on the Dolan stuff. This has been going on forever. I know that. But right. uh, for now, let's, let's try to enjoy this, okay? Okay. <laughs> put your hate in your back pocket is a very nice way to go about it. It also sounds like a nice jingle. Put your hate in your back pocket and just smile when Julius Randle passes off to Todd Gibson. I got it. I will do that. How does that sound, Diana? It sounds wonderful. Okay, very good. Thank you for helping me with that. Hey, you watched all the way to the end. Thanks for that. Watch more right here.